Two of Western New York's biggest developers are psyched they have the chance to turn the former Women and Children's Hospital campus into Elmwood Crossing. It's not an opportunity that you come across easily to find open land uh, right in the middle of the Elmwood Village. Ellicott Development and Sinatra and Company's joint redevelopment plan, which carries a $110 million price tag, has been in the works for over a year. It's one of the largest private, privately funded development projects in the city's history. And on Thursday, the public had its first chance to see the plans. This is going to absolutely change the dynamic in that corridor. Those plans call for 700,000 square feet of condos, townhouses, apartments, a grocery store, restaurants, retail, and plenty of green space. I applaud the fact that developers are coming in here with a vision and prepared to take financial and other risks to make it better. David Herr lives in the area. After seeing some of the renderings, he's concerned the development is too apartment heavy, which could crowd the neighborhood. From a neighborhood perspective, the people who live in the neighborhood are clearly going to be concerned about how it will impact their daily lives. Opinions like these are exactly why the public hearing was held. Public comment cards could be filled out and submitted so changes can be made. We look forward to engaging constructively with the developers and with the other people in our neighborhood. Once all these public comment cards are